Hey everyone, it's Graphic back with another video, and today we're going to be talking a little bit about a quick way to make a lot of money on your server before everybody else does. So, this is something that some people do every single day, but it's something that some people don't do every single day, and they should. So the first thing you're going to see here is I actually went to Syndicate thinking I was in Syndicate. I have to go all the way up to the Covenant Shop, and with the Covenant Shop, a Tier 2 item is going to be purchased. If you guys don't know much about this method, definitely check it out or try it out because if you are in a spot that has low trading tax for me, my bonuses are all in Everfall, so I'll buy my uh, specific products or my specific refined resources from Everfall and then I'll use the smelter there to actually do the conversion, but it's going to be a method that still works very, very well. So let's go to buy rewards, let's go to the Lumen, uh, sorry not Lumen, it's going to actually be in the Templar section and it's going to be only 100 a piece 100 faction tokens a piece and I bought 10 of these already so let's buy 20 just to kind of bump it up a little bit and every single I actually take a took a look at the market and these are selling for very very low right now very very low amounts the pure solvent and you should actually do this with your own pure solvent if you're not using it because it's not really worth anything but if we take a look at pure solvent real quick you can see that there is somewhat of a value and that's because people are using these to convert to other materials. So let's buy 100 more. It's 6 gold, 0.15. And we can actually see here, so that's going to be about 12 to 13 goldish for 200 pure solvent, right? Well, we also know flux is the highest when it comes to refined resources that are going to be used. It's going to be at 0.46 for this server. And it may be different depending on what server you're in, of course. But for us, 0.46 is going to be a huge jump from that 0 0.06 and we're going to take full advantage of it and I want to say as well you do want to check on your server because sometimes sandpaper can be higher typically that's the next in line so do make sure that uh, it's not one that you're missing out on maybe sandpaper is much higher in your server because people are already converting the others uh, but in this case let's go check out and see how this really all works out for us when it comes to the amount of gold you can make very very quickly so as we get over here i do want to say guys i actually don't have the level for this um and that doesn't really matter i mean obviously i'm just here to show you guys because i spent a lot of time pvping and a little bit of pve as well but this is something i've never really done is focused on getting all of my trade skills up to 200 so you can see that they're very very low across the board you know mining gathering stuff i do have pretty much uh, to 200 when it comes to mining and tracking and skinning, but harvesting, logging, some of these other ones, I really do have low, low trade skills. And it's because, I, like I said, I do spend a lot of time of my time making builds, doing PvP, kind of testing things, uh, making you guys videos and content. So that's something I've never got around to. But when we come over to the smelter, it's still going to be the same for you. You're going to come down here. All you need is 150 smelting and you can take advantage of this so if you take a look you actually have the pure solvent you'll need 20 pure solvents one converter to convert to 15 obsidian flux right so that's actually a huge difference in gold that you're going to get there so you have to remember every single pure solvent is about 0 0.06 and obsidian flux right now is selling for about 0.46 so you're going to make about 0.4 per obsidian flux you make uh, a little less because it is 15 instead of 20 but for the most part you understand it's going to be a nice little gain a nice little benefit to you guys if you do all 20 converters you're going to make quite a bit of money at the smelter and that's why you go to the smelter like i said is the the obsidian flux if you want to go to other locations like wire weave or sandpaper you can do that as well but uh it's going to be something you definitely want to take advantage of uh if we come down to the here we go. If we come down to the stone table, I was trying to think of what it was called there for a second. And if we go to add filter, craft, can craft my skills, it's going to make it a little bit easier on us. Uh, you can actually see if we go all the way to the bottom, actually it didn't make it easier on us at all. You can see here, so obsidian sandpaper. So this is something I can do. I do have stone cutting at 200 and pure solvent is going to be the one you're going to want to do. Uh, or sorry, obsidian sandpaper is going to be the one you want to do. Do not craft your your flux into sandpaper or sorry your flux into solvent so what we're going to do is go to sandpaper we're going to go to solvent we're going to craft 20 of these right so this is actually going to make me money anyway even though i can't do the obsidian flux you can see here we got 330 sandpaper and that's from 400 solvent so let's do the math on that real quick so 330 sandpaper times 0.33 which is what it's currently selling for is actually going to give us about 109 gold so let's go to the sandpaper and this is like i said the lower uh the lower tier for me if i was able to do obsidian flux you'd even make more 
but that's so, so quick. And if you buy a lot of those converters, you'll be able to make a lot of money very, very quickly. So let's go with, how much did we make? 330? So yeah, 108.9 gold for our 13 gold that we spent on uh, this solvent, which most of the time you're gonna have the solvent just sitting somewhere. You might as well go this route, sell the, uh, sell the resources off by using your converters. It's gonna be worth it for you for sure to take advantage of this method. And I actually wanna take a look at the converters. Because if you take a look at the Masterwork Material Converters, they're only selling for four gold a piece. So thank you guys again for all tuning in. I just kind of wanted to show you all of the different prices of these refined materials, how to take advantage of them, how to make money with the material converter, and why this is still a very viable method that a lot of people are using every single day to make thousands on your server. So hopefully you guys learned a little bit today about the refined resources and how to make a ton of money on your server. People are making thousands of gold every single day using these material converters on your servers. So take advantage, make the money with them. And if you guys haven't already, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel and turn notifications on. And then go over to twitch.tv slash iGraphicGuy and follow me there. We're gonna stream every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday at 6 p.m. Eastern. And I hope to see you guys tuning in. Thanks again for tuning in. I'll see you all in the next one.